Are you a first time buyer looking for your first home in Sittingbourne? Now I was speaking to a, a first time buyer the other day and they had a budget of up to 350,000. What they said to me today, we're in November, and they said to me they were gonna hold off until the new year. I don't know if you are aware at the moment, but what the government is doing is they're going to be changing the first time buyer relief from the 1st of April 2025, where you as a first time buyer, you won't be paying any stamp duty up to 300,000, but anything, an additional amount over that, you're going to be paying a extra 5% on top of. So for instance, this person was looking up to 350. So the difference between 300 and 350, looking at 5% of that, it was an extra two and a half thousand pounds. So they said to me, yeah, that's fine. We want to wait until the new year. But also what she didn't know was the fact that transactions at the moment on average, right across the board nationally, are taking 152 days to go from sale agreed to completion. So if you look at the day today, which is the 4th of November, if you work on that average time frame, they will be completing on the 3rd of April. The likelihood is you're going to be paying stamp duty of two and a half thousand. So if you are currently a first time buyer that is looking and you wanted to put your whole, your search off until the new year, I would strongly urge you to consider potentially looking and trying to find something now as you could potentially miss out on a couple of thousand pounds that you're gonna have to find yourself and pay once you complete on the property. So I know there's not a huge amount of first time buyers that can are fortunate enough to be able to look up to this sort of figure. But as I said, I would seriously consider looking for a property now because as I said generally the whole process and although we'd love everything to go through in eight weeks if you're leaving it until the new year when new properties are coming on or you're waiting for the market to drop or anything along those lines at the moment the market um, is pretty reasonable we're still selling properties it's not firing on all cylinders but ultimately you could be in a situation where you're gonna have to find an additional amount of money to pay the government so if you want any more advice about what's happening in the market then by all means click on the link here or if you're not registered on our main list and you want to be alerted of new properties coming to the market that aren't on right move or zoopla yet we do a lot of off-market selling we've, we've had a couple of people recently that come to us and said they've missed out please click on this link so, so we do market a lot of properties behind the scenes for two to three weeks so please register your details here anything else give us a call cheers bye